channel um this is my great friend Tasia. she's been my friend since freshman year of high school right yes that's so dang it's been like what seven six years i, I can't know keep count I'm, i failed at math guys <laughs> <laughs> i was good at math but i failed at math so yeah but we met in english class english yep yes. that's our strong shoot english <laughs> yes <laughs> yeah. oh my god but um yeah so oh my gosh she brought this box um can y'all see that okay y'all can see that um pause the video if you need to read it but it so basically says naruto well this is this is a uh, shonen jump naruto shippuden or bruto naruto next generations mystery snack box <laughs> yes what she said <laughs> i'm an anime watcher i'm a weeb as some people call it a weeb i'm not <laughs> <laughs> nothing wrong with that nothing i'm just kidding i kind of am a weeb just a little bit just i like the depressing animes and the like real life animes i don't know why my life just hasn't been the like that sad or anything lately so like i need to get my <laughs> sadness from somewhere <laughs> oh my gosh yes anime has lots of that for you sis don't worry yeah Anyway, she kind of um opened a box already. <laughs> <laughs> I was curious. I was, it was, curiosity got the best of me, as we can tell. <laughs> Whatever. But I have yet to see what's inside. So like, I could see what's inside if I open it. Are you, are you ready? Yes. Oh my god! <laughs> the things in here are so cute. Like the packaging is like really cute. But I don't watch Naruto like that, but I don't either. It smells nice. <laughs> it smells nice. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Oh, okay. I see a little. What? what? Oh, my head is kind of tiny. What's that? Oh my god. Okay. It's kind of a. Uh... Oh, it's cute. I told you. Oh. I know. Oh. I told you. <gasps> the packagings are really cute. It's so cute, y'all. I. How, how should we show them? Um, we could go one by one. One by one? Are we uh, gonna try the things one by one too? Yeah. Okay. What do you want to try first? I don't know. I'm Asian, but I don't know the name or what half of these taste like. By the way, my ethnicity is Hmong, but I think majority of these are Japanese, not Chinese. So, if you know your characters, this should be Japanese, not Chinese. Yeah. Well, since you showed this one already. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's okay. do this one first. So, we're going to do this one first. Um, if I if I edit nicely, I'll take a picture of it and show y'all later. <laughs> if I'd be so kind. But I don't, we don't know how to say this. Yeah, we don't know, I don't know how to say it. I can't read Japanese characters. So, we'll but, just... Yeah. Go with what it looks like and what it tastes like. Yeah? Yeah, it looks like little, um, what does it look like to you? Little crackers? Yeah, it looks like little crackers. With some good seasoning. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. By the way, I also got this at Mall of America or MOA as Minnesotans like to call it. MOA. <laughs> okay, so, oh, oh. That is very small. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it would be bigger. They look like um Pringles. Yeah, like if, like this was like a cylinder standing up. They look like tiny Pringles. Yeah, they're like y'all. They're like really tiny. Yeah. I don't know if y'all can see that, but they're like really tiny. They're like mini versions of Pringles. Yeah. You wanna try it? Yeah. Really? Oh, that sounds good though. <laughs> <laughs> It, this texture is like Pringles. I don't know how to describe the seasoning though. The taste though. Yeah, the taste is interesting. It's not bad. Yeah. 
That's not my favorite type of texture for chips. I like, as y'all know, I love me some flaming Hot Nacho Doritos. <laughs> Those are my favorite type of chips. Just kind of spiciness to them. Mm. But these, it's not really spicy. It's like, yeah. how would you describe it? Um, kind of like um, like a very subtle onion type. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But like these are like they're a good size for like if you want like a midnight snack and like you don't mm -hmm. want anything that's like too crunchy or like too big and you just, you just kind of want to snack on something very small. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it's it's like one of those things where like you can because it's like a subtle onion taste. Mm -hmm. It's not like you can get tired of it. You know? Yeah. I don't know, I'm not really feeling it. <laughs> <laughs> no, just because, I don't know. I just don't like the onion taste to it. That's fair, that's fair. Yeah. You want to move on to the next one? Yeah, let's Yeah, let's move on to the next one. You could keep these after the food. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I'll take it. My brothers okay. will eat it. We probably do a point system, like, which one is our favorite? Yeah. Okay, I would. Oh, one out of ten, what would you give this? One being bad, five being you could eat this if you're really feeling hungry, and ten as in you would buy this if you saw it in the store. I give it a four. A four? <laughs> yeah. That's fair. I I would give it a five out of ten. It's like I'm not feeling it either, but like I could eat it if I'm like super hungry mm -hmm. and it's like a midnight snack. So I could I could go for it. Yeah, if it's like the only thing I have to snack on and I don't have to cook, mm -hmm. I'll eat it. Yeah, you know. <laughs> but like, yeah. <laughs> um, these are like little Oreos. Yeah, can y'all see that? Basically Oreos. Yes. Basically Oreos. Wheat cracker. Oh, is that the name? I think it might be. Wait, is there a name on this one? Oh, is it? Is it? Potato cracker. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> yep. Um, yeah. Okay, so on here it does say the name, okay? We yeah. just want to pay attention. We're kind of so. <laughs> That's why we filled classes in high school. Girl, don't expose me like that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. So. I hope this really don't taste like wheat, but it says oh. wheat cracker. <laughs> Wait, does it? Yes, wheat cracker. No, well, this is right here. Yama, Yamazaki Nor Mini Sand. What does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> sorry, guys. Sorry for the foreign language. Smell it. It's basically Oreo. Oreo. Yeah. <laughs> it smells like an Oreo. Yeah, it's basically Oreo. My table is clean. <laughs> yeah, I wiped it out for this video. Oh my gosh. I'm not a big Oreo fan. You're not? No. I love Oreos. Like the Oreo cookie itself, I'm not a big fan mm. of it. But if it's like Oreo flavor things, I can I can eat it. Oh, I didn't snap on this though. It's like a cute small um Oreo bite size. They taste like Oreo. The <laughs> the chocolate flavor flavor is actually more intense. Oh really? I've never had the chocolate mm -hmm. flavor. No, like just like the um, like just the outer layer of this. Mm. Oh. You taste a lot more chocolate. Can y'all see that? You like, taste. It's a, they're all. I think they're all like very small sizes. Like if you yeah. compare. Oh, you can't probably can't see that. You want to bring it up to the. No. Oh my god. Y'all could zoom in. <laughs> okay, here, I'll do it. Oh, she nice. I I was gonna stay here. Like, do you see this? It's like they're very small sizes. Yeah. They're bite size. Yeah. It's really cute. Something like that. Yes. Would you they taste good together? I wouldn't eat it together. Why you not? Could try. <laughs> Do what you're going through with it. <laughs> I've never taken two things together. One that was a lot of chocolate and a lot of onion. Mm -hmm. Are you taking that one? Yeah. Okay. Um, you want to pick the next thing? 
out of 10, what would you give that? I give it a six. Just because um, I didn't really like the like how the chocolate, how you tasted a lot of chocolate. It tastes like kind of like dark chocolate. And I don't like dark chocolate mm -hmm. like that. And that flavor really intensified at the end. Like after like the aftertaste, that's when you really taste it. And like some people might like that, but I really don't. But like, I like it better than onion. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's fair. All right, so I picked a random one. It says Bruto Biscuit. Oh, so is it like a cookie thingy? Probably. I know biscuit in other languages it means cookie, so let's give it a try. Ooh. I don't smell anything. You don't? Wait. Because you know, do two at once when we when we look at the camera, you know. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I thought they would have like these other two characters, characters too. Oh, you can't see it, but you guys can zoom in. But they don't. It smells like um ah. Well, I can't think of the name, but um. Oh, it tastes like it too. Um. Animal crackers? Not animal crackers. Um, oh, tastes like animal crackers to me. <laughs> I, I like animal crackers though, so it's like, it's good. Mm. It's not bad. I don't snack on it. I wouldn't snack on it unless I have to though. Mm. So you rate it like a two or three? I would think like a four, a four? out of ten. Yeah. I rate this about a six. Actually like seven. Out of everything I tasted so far, this is my favorite. Just cause <laughs> it's, yeah, it's plain and simple. Mm. And it's like sweet enough, but like not too sweet. It has, um, does it have, I can't get the name, um, but, um, you know those, uh, cookies, those like kind of like, not peanut butter, um, those like butter cookie that comes in that circular like the can, what? and it's blue. Yeah, let me see if I can search it out. Wow. Yeah, okay. have a different one. I'm not registering what she's saying. <gasps> okay. Um. Oh, okay. This looks good. I've been eyeing these for a while. Okay, wait. Let me go up there and like, while she's searching that up, let me go up there to show y'all what these are. These look good. I don't know what the heck they are, but they look so good. And then this was the Baruto one. It's really cute packaging. Um, let me open one so, like, y'all could see what it looks like or whatever. Why can't I open this? <laughs> you closed it. Oh, okay, I opened it. This looks really cute. Really cute. Oh, my gosh. Her. Oh, I have it. This you is have what it? it looks like. Yeah. Oh. JK. These. Oh. Those. It tastes like Royal Discus. Discus. That's why Royal I like it. Dansk. 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 The Danish uh, butter cookies. You know, I'm pretty sure some of the viewers know what I'm talking about, especially if you're like POC. Like, yeah. POC people love these cookies. You they are why? so good. They are. And you know why? It's because they use the box for sewing kits afterwards. I don't use it for sewing kits, but I do use it as storage. <laughs> Exactly. These are really cute. Oh my gosh, look, it's like a triangle face thing. Oh my god. Packaging. It's everything. Ah, this is so adorable. Wait, what's the name? Oh, it just says, oh, it says jelly. And then it says, uh, Tsuyama. Okay, I am not a Japanese speaker, so I'm sorry if I offend anyone. Um, it says Tsuyamaya Hanatsumi Jelly. I only know some pronunciation, and I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm butchering it too because I watch anime. 
Yes, the packaging is to die for. It's like, how did they do this? Oh like, I showed y'all up there when I was up there, but like, how did they do this? I know, it's so adorable. I don't even want to eat it. I think it's so cute. We, and could, like, we could just open one then. Yeah, and like the color of these jelly cubes are adorable. They're to die for. Oh Literally, my you could tell they, they packaged this with, specifically with the colors. Because each color set is different. Oh, you're right. Yeah. <gasps> that is so Because, like, the yellow and the green openings have, like, the springy colors and stuff. Yeah. And then the blue with the red has, like, more fall, um, like, winter. Yeah. Like, cutesy oh, winter vibes. so cute. Wait, so which color set do you want to open? Um, Let's open this one since it's one more. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I was okay. just going to say. You want to keep them, though? Because I... I'm okay with this. I'm probably not. I'll take one, if you don't mind. Yeah. For my baby brother, but we can keep smell it. It smells so nice. Ooh, that's such a sweet smell. Oh my gosh. It's super squishy too. You can feel the sugar on top. Mm. 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 It's just like straight up sugar. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. It doesn't taste like anything. It's just like straight up sugar. It yeah. tastes really sweet. I like it. And it's like, it's not like those regular gummies, you know, that like, you know, that takes a while to chew and swallow. Mm. Or you could chew it more if you want to, but. Yeah, it's like, um, I like to categorize, um, jellies by like hard jellies, chewy jellies, and like soft jellies. This is like a hard jelly where you just bite into it. And you chew a couple of times and you're good. But it's like just like straight up sugar. Straight up. But it tastes good. Like it's like and like they don't have a lot in a bag. Mm -hmm. So it's like you're only getting a couple of sugar at a time. Yeah. So not bad, not bad. It's really good. And it's only 35 calories. Oh, that's not bad. See? Yeah. Wow, that's really good actually. You want the other two? <clears throat> you take one, I take one. Yeah. There's for each. And these are like good for like days where like it's like you want something sweet, but like you don't know what to eat. Because I have those things, mm -hmm. and that would be good for that. Because there's like four in each. It's super sweet, there's but it's so. I, I ate it. Oh, you did. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I can't. Oh, there is five. I can't. I can't. <laughs> but like, it's like one of. It's like these are good for like a random day where you're just like, I'm feeling sweet, but not too much sweet. Yeah. I like it. I like it. Me le gusta también. Guys, <laughs> this is just the trash. Uh -huh. You want to pick the next thing? Oh, cool. I like it said, oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. It says pink salt potato chips and it says Choji approved. So if you watch Naruto or Naoto, um, you'll know who Choji is. And then this is what the packaging looks like. It's really cute. It's really it has, nice. Yes. It has the three main characters that everyone know in Naruto. It's Naruto, Sasuke, and oh, pointing at the wrong person. Sasuke and the Sakura. But it's potato chips. They have some big heads. Like me. <laughs> like me. <laughs> Potato chips that look just normal. Lay's. Lay's. Lay's, yeah. The regular um, original potato chips. The Lay's original. Yeah, that's potato what they chips. look like. But the picture on here looks different. I thought they would be like. More seasoned looking? No, you know those like puffed up chips? Yeah. That, I thought this is what like it was. Yeah. Well, this is what it is. And then obviously, it's probably it probably has pink salt on there because it does say pink salt. It smells like Lay's too. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> they look like normal potato chips, y'all. Yeah. Like nothing, like just like Lay's. Mm hmm. So it's probably gonna taste like Lay's, huh? Mm hmm. It tastes like Lay's. This reminds me why I don't like Lay's chips. Yeah. Oh, you don't like it either? No. <laughs> I don't like it. Because their Lay's chips are so salty. Like, that's the whole point of it, but they're just so salty. I don't like them. They're, it's not salty enough for me. Really? I don't like that. I would probably put some more salt on this. <laughs> Talk about diabetes. Uh, I can't. I'm going to be a diet. <laughs> um, but, I don't want to try another one of these. Out of these, how much would, what would you give it? Oh, out of those? A good 10. It's for 10? 10 for me. It's sweet, and I'm not a big, big person of sweet, so I'll give it like a 9 out of 10. I love these. Packaging and everything, A+, plus, but 9 out of 10. Yeah, like honestly, it, it, it came through with everything you wanted it to come through with, yes. you know? And so it's a nine, a 10 out of 10 for me. Huh. But these... 1 out of 10. I'm not a big fan yeah. of Lay's chips. I'm not either. I'm, I'm going to give these to somebody. <laughs> I'll take it. Okay, you could take it for your brothers? Yeah. yeah. My bro I have five brothers. One of those bad asses will eat them. <laughs> yeah, please take them. We'll do the drinks last because okay. there's two of them. Oh, okay. Oh, what are these? I'm scared to try that. <laughs> Should we wait for this one? This is sugar candy. Oh no, that's not the one I'm scared to try. You know what? Don't, don't show me yet. Don't show me. Don't show me. Okay. See, she already peeped through the box. I'm just grabbing stuff. First come, first serve. <laughs> okay. That's a sugar candy. So. Yes, yeah, sugar candy. Ingredients, sugar, and coloring. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. You have it. Sugar candy. Wow. It's so cute though. The packaging is like really cute. Y'all could zoom in for that. Yes. It has, here, I'll give the names. It has, um, okay, just ignore me for a second because I am a big anime guy. Uh, not anime guy. I am like a big, I sip on anime guys, okay? There's my Kakashi. Daddy, daddy is fuck. Daddy is fuck. Daddy Kakashi. <laughs> I'm just playing. I'm just, I'm not playing, but I'll, I'll stop there. I'm pretty sure there are young kids watching this too. Let me not. And then there's um Sakura. actually my viewers are um between the ages a lot of like fifty percent of them are between the ages um nineteen and thirty-five. Well that's good. I know some of you guys <laughs> sim for anime men's too, so I'm not even gonna shame on myself for that. But he is daddy as fuck if you know who he is. And then there's Naruto, and then there's Sakura, and then there's Sasuke. And I know a lot about animes, uh, Naruto, but I forget the fox's name. So there's there's him too. Forgive me. I I'll search and I'll search up his name if you guys want me to, and I'll pop into another video and give the name if you guys are not happy. But there's the fox guy for you too. Gosh, we should do another video together. Sure. Okay. Oh. Can you open the door? <laughs> I opened it. Mission <laughs> successful. Is it a reusable bag too? Yeah, Ziploc. Wow, they really thought it through. Yeah. Uh, American stores could never. Ooh, it smell it smells nice. Ooh. It's, it looks like popcorn. Yeah. Or um rock candy. You know the rock candy's on a stick? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it looks That's what it looks, looks like. like. Um, I'll take pictures of everything later and like put them and like probably above our heads or something. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I almost broke my teeth for this. It's straight up sugar, as it says, but I thought it would like have a chew to it. It's I'm, a hard rock. <laughs> I'm scared to chew it. I'm just gonna. <laughs> it's like all with my saliva. <laughs> it's like hard rock, but it's like so small that you can't even taste any sweetness unless you do what he did or what he's doing, and you're like just like fucking. It's not the right word. <laughs> you're like 
melting it with your saliva, saliva. as he said. You taste a little sweetness, but like you really don't taste that much sugar. Yeah. It's like it's, it feels to me. It's like one of those fidget things, you know. Mm. If you just want something like to like pop in your mouth to like like gum or something, mm -hmm. just put it yeah. in there and just like leave it alone. Yeah, I I think this is my first one. I would give ten out of ten though, because it's like a fun like thing to just pop in your mouth if you <clears throat> want to keep your mouth busy. Yeah. Like if you're like doing homework or you're like reading, um, and you need to keep your mouth busy. This is this is like actually really good for that, and I say that because I read a lot, so I would recommend this. I would recommend it too. Um, like if you like you know like leave it in your mouth for the saliva to dissolve it a little bit. Um, if you chew it on it, then it's really soft. Yes. And like the that you feel the sugar disperse about. You feel the sugar spread amongst your teeth as you're chewing it, and it's like a really nice flavor to it the packaging is really cute too mm -hmm. i would say like if you get a closer look at it it's really cute and like i said they did think a lot of these through like this one is like ziplog the the cookie one right there is, is ziplog it's so adorable yeah the packaging for these are just really adorable yeah i would have made it a nine out of ten mm -hmm. yeah surprisingly you can keep that i'm not gonna keep that <laughs> okay. oh, you, do you want to keep Y'all yeah, keep it. Okay. Because I've been reading a lot too. Mm -hmm. Hi, everyone. Um, oh, shoot. So, um, sorry I stopped the video so abruptly. But, oh my gosh, this <laughs> the place I am is scaring me low key. So, um, it's almost 7.30. And like I've been in the editing lab. My school has an editing lab, by the way. Fun fact: I knew it existed, like at the like last semester or whatever. But I never used it because I was like, has shit to do with me. But it has a lot to do with me since I make YouTube videos. And so I'm now using the, using the editing lab for my videos because I used to use my tablet. But I was like, it's kind of ghetto. So I want to edit with actual editing software. And I was emailing my film professor, and I love her by the way. Um, I was emailing my film professor or whatever, and she was like, um, "Go to either the library or the editing lab to like edit the videos, you know." I was no, I asked her for an editing software that I should use, and she said um, Premiere Pro. And so I was not about to pay twenty dollars a month to edit videos, and I only post four videos a month in the summer, and then. It's, my channel is going to be like low-key non-existent in the school year so i was like i know four dollars a month i mean twenty dollars a month i think not so i went to the library they didn't have it as library so i went to the editing lab and they have it in the editing lab of course because it's an editing lab duh and it's low-key nice and stuff um but it's really creepy <laughs> It's in the basement of like one of the buildings. It's in the basement of the music building, but nobody really goes in here. Um, well, okay, I'm a social work major, so I don't go in here at all. I stay in like the newest building and like the other old building, not this old building. I don't even know if this building is old. I, I don't know. All I know is like the basement is so freaking creepy. And uh, I just heard a sound so I'm stopping this video right now <laughs> and plus um the video itself like the whole video of us like me and my friend Pasia talking is a good like 50 minutes almost an hour so I was like I was planning to stop at halfway anyways because I'm like I know y'all not gonna watch a video for a whole hour like child I know y'all I see I see how many times y'all click on this video and i see how long y'all watch the video for i know y'all are not gonna watch it for an hour and i was like 20 minutes 30 minutes is a nice break to um stop the video so yeah i'm gonna stop the video and you're gonna watch the next either next week or the week after that is to still be determined right now it's wednesday so i have a lot of time to pick and decide when i want to try to watch it but yes also sorry to look like a bum I've been at work and I've been editing and it's an office job and I'm sitting down so like no one's impressed but myself and I'm like I feel good I look good yeah but anyways I'll see y'all next week bye